Okay, I don't understand why it's worse now than what it was five hours ago. Smells now like uh, chemicals. I couldn't really smell the chemicals before. So the, the pump wasn't running at full capacity because I had an air leak in the hose. So I put duct tape around the hose to, and then it went, and it started going, and it had like massive suction, and then the hose just got fat, and now it's moving a lot more. Oh, wow. Is that going to help? So that's why it was going so slow. Because it wasn't at full capacity. Oh man. That's interesting. Here's our pool water. It's going all the way to the pool. So we're going to go to Bonnie and Clyde's pool store and get our new system for the pool that we don't have to use chlorine anymore. I'll show you what we find. So this is what we bought. It's called Oxygen Pools. It's a generator. We no longer need this nasty chlorine tube for the water. Here's what it looks like on our pump. And there is no chlorine or salt with this type of system. It does come with its own powder to put in. Oxygen pool. So this is what we're going to be putting in. Look how clean this water is now. I am ready to jump in. This was a two day, very long process, about eight hours each doing the research, getting the supplies cleaning this. We found out this pool is actually 9,000 gallons. We thought it was 6,500. Got our skimmer going. Look at that clean basket. This is so great. So basically, what does this do, honey? What did he say it does? It um, does something with the molecules? It changes the molecules in the oxygen from uh, O2 down to O1. And that means or does, but we, we're not pool, pool experts yet, but pool we definitely know more than I did two days ago. <laughs> it's like a fish tank. I love it. Oh my gosh, he totally has our laugh, doesn't he? Did you get your mother's laugh, Chandler? You poor thing. Yeah, look at that. And take two of emptying the pool. All right, let's talk about this. We uh, are the emptying pool. the pool the second time. Yeah. Okay. That was that was where the hole that she found. Okay, that's kind of in the middle. That's I thought it was it, more it, over there. No, it's right, it's right here where my hand is. Mm, that's right by, the, right stairs by the stairs when we moved it. I moved the stairs out and then I tilted them up, so mm. that would make sense. We're gonna blow bubbles. We're celebrating. We are gonna make this a positive thing of why we had to empty the, the pool. Because of our emotional bag. Emotional baggage. Lots of drama going on with things that we need to cope with. And this is the universe oh, be careful because teaching be us that if we do not have a hold of our emotions, you will have flooding.
we have lots of emotional trauma going on, lots of lack of communication, and we just have filled this pool with beautiful water, beautiful spirits of fun, positive energy. And there's things that happen with your subconscious. I kind of saw it coming as an empath and it really took effect. The flooding will happen after the realization of emotional chaos going on in your life. So we are releasing it all. We accept it. We are very thankful to have our spiritual awareness to understand what's going on. And we have our elders. Our elders and wisdom of them are teaching us. So we respect them. We ask them for guidance. And through all this, the flooding is going to result in another beautiful day. We're going to fill our pool. We're going to have more joyful memories that occur on this property that we have to live on for the rest of our life. I'm thinking it's because of the tube that that thing is like leaking. understand why it's worse now than what it was five hours ago. Some of this water is from the swimming pool, but guess what? Some of it is also from Alyssa leaving the hose on over in her little garden area. I just came out here just now, this morning, and the hose over there to her garden is running full blast. I'll turn it off. So here's her hose. Going over here, there's the water, and it runs over here. this corner and all that water is running right here under the deck and then in here from here it goes under the deck all the way over under our pool comes out over on the side of the pool and goes all the way down the side of the yard wow look at that crater that's like mars right there so this is all tape it's called flex tape. It's a really strong pool liner tape. The moment of truth. We're gonna fill up the pool. It's suspenseful. Is it going to leak or is it not going to leak? As of now, the pool is not leaking. It's beautiful. And We've it's got our clean. new oxygen system that's it's managing, clean yes, it's clean clear. and clear. The kids are swimming. And guess what? The emotions have tamed down. We have a bubble of protection around this neighborhood with like minded neighbors. We're all looking after each other. We have teamwork. And all of those emotions were happening with this leak of the pool because there was so much chaos going on in our life that I'm not going to go into, but just know that Mother Nature and the universe teaches you what's going on in your life by what's going on around you and your emotions. And you wanna to try to keep them um, to not get to that point. But we didn't know and we're just now learning and listening. All is good, stay safe guys, stay healthy, and we will see you in the next video. Whoa, what the? what's that? Whoa. Oh, it's a little seahorse.
Oh mm -hmm. my gosh! Looks like a seahorse. That's um, so crazy. How, how long has that been in there? Whoa! It looks kind of Native American-like. Like, look at the face. 